the rebels be planning here? A photograph of Lord Hastings. They're getting organized. The Agamemnon shipping manifest. All the cargo is destined for the Americas. This poor sod was burned beyond recognition. He was surely tortured first. Sleep, my child, and peace attend thee all through the night. Noble knights, our king will send thee all through the night. Drowsy owls are creeping here. I'm keeping all through the night while the lady in her watchful dreaming all through the night while the weary world is sleeping all through the night Visions of delight revealing Breathe the pure and holy feeling All through the night Noble nights watching ever round thee Slumbers close around thee all through the night. They will of all fears disarm thee. No foreboding should alarm thee. They will let no peril harm thee. Oh. 
to all representatives of the southern chapters. We are to convene in the next few weeks. No. Summons and subsequent instructions will be forwarded to your respective locales. Be aware that inquiries have been made regarding a few of the members by both the police and the Royal Army. The latter does prove more worrisome and should not be taken lightly. Thus, I urge everyone to mind their interactions with any new acquaintance. Though our focus and watch should remain on the order and its ranks, we suggest that time be spent on gathering further information on the reorganized rebellion. Their factions seem too well maintained and coordinated, which would suggest external oversight or, or help. It would also explain their sudden resurgence. United India uniforms. No ranks or assignments on the sleeves. That must be it. Percival, come in. Percival! to have me worried. Galahad, where in the world have you been? Percival, we may have a situation on our hands. What is it? First, call in Nicola. We'll need armament. The rebels turn the psychiatric ward into a hideout and what looks like a staging area. There are clues that indicate a potential threat to the United India Company and Lord Hastings. I'm telling you, I'm fine now. You still need some time to recuperate. I assure you, Gray, I'm perfectly well. Will there ever be a time when you will heed my advice, Izzy? You know the answer to that question. But you would have to obtain Father's blessing first. My friend Galahad. Well, Marquis, where have your concerns for my well-being gone? Oh, Mademoiselle, I never doubted for a moment that you would prevail over these miscreants. However, the same cannot be said of your gallant knight. <laughs> Not a word of this to anyone, Nicola, understand? As you wish. You are taking a big risk. What did I tell you, Monsieur? We'd almost given you up for lost. I... We were unavoidably detained. Come, we don't have much time. Sir, this is for you as well. It should all be in working order. Thank you, Nicola. And the other weapon? Ah, yes. You never fail to deliver. Percival, for you. Might come in handy. The Agamemnon, what's its status? It has already departed. On its way to Portsmouth for its last port of call before it leaves for the Americas. And the security detail on board? Have they been made aware of the rebel threat? For all we know, the guard detail could have been infiltrated by the conspirators. We need to unravel this without arousing suspicion. The Council should at least be apprised of this situation. We don't have the luxury of seeking the Council's permission. We're getting aboard that ship. And how would you suggest we do that, Mon General? It is already airborne. That should be easy. You read my mind. Sentinel-5, we are on board. Acknowledged, Sir Percival. Sentinel-5 is eating back and will remain available for support. Confirmed. Thanks for the drop-off, Captain. Good luck, sir. Sentinel-5, out. Is this your idea of easy, monsieur? We're all secure, Percival. 
We move on your mark. Very well. Precarious, my friend. Giving up so soon, Marquis. In position. Uh. I'll shatter you. Uh. Let's go. Let's get inside! Stow your gear. Lafayette and Galahad, you need to get control of the cockpit. Quietly. Understood. Isabeau and I will do reconnaissance. We need eyes on the ground amongst the guests. And imagine me with nothing to wear. I suppose I'll have to go dress shopping. Rules of engagement, monsieur? Do what you must. We don't have time to distinguish between rebel conspirators and the company guards. Well, we've worked without a safety net before. That is true. But then again, we are commandeering the flagship of the United India Company's fleet. Questions? Then let's move out. Sebastian, I must ask you. Who is the old man you are talking to on Mayfair Whitechapel? The old man. It's a long story, one that I will share with you when the time is right. There's still much that I have to find out for myself. I hope you know what you are doing. It seems that the Council grows wary of your defiance. The Order is not what it once was, Grayson. Yes, you've said that much before. <laughs> Patience, old friend, all in due time. <laughs> 